There is a Kurdish proverb that says that out of extreme hardship comes good things. Saddam Hussein was killing Kurds and I was active in the Kurdish movement against him. I decided I need to take my family out of uh, Iraq. In 1976, a young Kurdish family from Iraq moved to Minot, North Dakota as refugees. Scared and homeless, this was the beginning of their journey in becoming American. I had two children, um, pregnant with the third. I didn't know English. My daughter, Shino, was born. After four months, uh, she passed away. Like any American family, the Mustafas struggled to live this quote-unquote American dream. But by 1991, they saw that work begin to pay back when Harrow was accepted to Georgetown University. Now what's interesting is that when she moved to Washington, the entire family moved with her. There's no doubt in my mind that the single most important person in the development of the, of the governments and economic growth in the northern Iraq is Harold Mustafa. Coming to this country under the most uh, difficult of circumstances, um, it's no, no wonder that she is as dedicated as she is to helping other people find freedom. America is the land of opportunity, the land of freedom, it's a land of hope. I was about four years old when they moved in with us, and that's about 30 years ago now. I remember them saying, we may never be able to return to our country, our home, Iraq, but now they get to. And I can tell you I'm certain I never imagined that they would invite me to go with them. Home is the place where they were born. For me, Iraq is the place that gave me birth, but America is the place that gave me freedom. 